You don't believe in the theory that protostars come from dark matter nebula explosions, do you? Uh, I believe there's evidence that supports... I heard that all the top Klingon cosmologists believe in that theory. Um... You don't agree with the Klingons, do you? They killed Lieutenant Stevens back on Grignor 7. Hmm. I guess I shouldn't agree with him. Stevens was a friend of mine. Excuse me, gentlemen. I couldn't help overhearing. Yes, sir? The argument you are employing, Helmsman, is not logical. In fact, it exhibits the fallacy of ad hominem. In other words, attack the man. Or in this case, the Klingons. The argument seems to make sense. That may be so, Lieutenant, but the form of the argument is invalid. This fallacy attacks the character of individuals who advance the statement, instead of trying to disprove the truth of that statement. The fact that Klingon cosmologists believe in a theory does not make that theory false. Recall that Klingon engineers believe in warp propulsion theory, just as we do. Well, that is not to say that your conclusion is not correct. It is just that your argument does nothing to prove it. Thank you, Mr. Spark. Yes, I should rethink what I'm trying to say. That would be best. Even if an argument seems to make sense, it cannot be valid unless the form is valid and that it does not exhibit one of the logical fallacies such as ad hominem or attacking the person advocating a particular idea. It's only logical.